one is more. Today, we got just kind of a fun, sit down, lo-fi, chill, rambly, tappy tap sort of video. I feel like I haven't actually sat down and hung out with you guys for a little while while doing some triggers. So that's the goal for today. And I'm also going to be showing, showing off. It's not much to show off, but um, my sneaker and hat collection. I have a lot of sneakers. Well, I used to have more. I actually gave a lot away recently. Um, but a decent amount of sneakers, but I have a lot of hats. I have a lot of hats. So I figured we could do a little bit with that. Uh, I also just kind of chit chat, ramble to you about what I've been up to recently. Of course, now I have a hangnail. Mm. And just to be all the comments, I know I look exhausted. First of all, I am. Second of all, I also always have these eye bags. Some people, some people like to point them out every once in a while, but little do they know, I don't know. I'm not going to be able to find a, a photo, I'm sure, but there are pictures of me from when I was a little kid with eye bags. I just always had eye bags. <laughs> it's just the way my face looks, people. I'm sorry about it. I don't know how long this video is going to be, but I'm going to try to keep the back half a little less rambly and the front half a little more rambly, but we'll see how that goes. on the first hat while while I got you here. I got this one. I got this for Christmas last year. Pretty solid. I think it's so goofy. I love unique looking hats. Um, and I think this, this meets the bill. So first of all, let's talk, why, talk about why I'm so tired. Uh, basically, I didn't sleep last night because um, I got back in at midnight my time, a flight, a flight got in at midnight, and then I watched a World Cup game, I watched a World Cup game, I watched a World Cup game until like 2, and then the US played at 5, so I like tried to take a nap, for a couple hours but did not succeed and ended up staying up the whole night and then watching the game at five. And they lost, they lost, they lost, they lost and I'm still grieving that fact, <laughs> but what can you do? And then I was already up and I just had to go on a long run, long run for me. I've been trying to get back into running. I used to do track in high school, the track and field. track and field, track and field, track and field. I did like sprints and shorter distance and then I also did long jump. Long jump. I was terrible, terrible at all of it. <laughs> I'm very short so I'm not really built to be a track star. But it was fun. It kept me in shape and um, and I learned right then and there that I actually don't really like running on my own for pleasure. I don't really get a lot out of it. I mean, the whole runner's high thing, like, yeah, it's, it's like semi-true. So I'm trying to readjust. Semi-true, but like, I don't know. I just don't like running. <laughs> but I've been trying to get back into it, trying to get into shape, and just kind of, um, I don't know, push my will, see what I can do. I want to get like a really good mile time like I'm not trying to go for like I'm not trying to I'm not training for a half marathon or anything or a full marathon or anything of that nature I just want to get um to be able to run like five-ish miles at a time at a decent pace and I want to get 
a really good mild time. I mean, really good for me. It would be like, I don't know, when I was younger, when I was younger and for some reason could run well, I think I could get like around sub, sub seven minutes, probably like 640-ish, I want to say, was probably like one of my fastest times ever. And that, was, that was a long, 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 long time ago. long time ago now I'm like getting around eight minutes which isn't too bad but eh, closer to nine but um which I'm not unhappy with as long as I can you know do a few miles a few miles at a time and that's what I did today I ran more than usual, more than usual, about three miles, and I was running that around a 10 minute split, which I want to get lower, but I'm just rambling, who cares, whatever. <laughs> but yeah, so I ran at like 7 in the morning, 8.30, 7.30, 8.30, I don't even remember anymore. And I tried to take a nap because I didn't sleep. And it's one of those naps where like you're like in and out and like I was like sweaty and like my dreams are weird. It was a weird one. So I only took a nap for a couple hours and I was like, screw it, I'm done. It's time. It's more time. Cause I've been looking forward to making this video for a while because I haven't actually sat down and lo fi chit chatted with y'all. Sorry about the background noise. I don't know why people are being loud. Right, let's do one of my sneakers, yeah? Why don't we do this one on the end? Um, disclaimer, whoa, we got really bright all of a sudden. I used to consider myself a novice sneakerhead. I do not anymore. I, first of all, I'm terrible with names. I have no idea like what most sneakers like names are, even after I buy them. Um, and also, I just like simply don't have enough and don't have any that are like interesting or rare or even ones that are that expensive. But I like what I like. And another reason is I wear my sneakers. I do not protect them. I, I, I live in those suckers. I kind of wish I didn't sometimes because I hate seeing especially like white sneakers. I like white shoes. They just turn brown and I don't really do much to stop it. <laughs> All right, but the first pair I got are these Converse. I think they're pretty sweet. The orange inside, they don't have laces, right? They came with laces. They came with like, they're almost like rope material laces. But they were reflective. So like if you took a picture of them, they would like glow. And I ended up putting those in a different pair of shoes, which I never wear. Um, I don't really wear these very much either, but you don't actually need laces. Like they, the tongue is pretty tight, almost all the way up to the top. So I never wear them with laces. And I think they're pretty cool. I don't know. Like I don't I've never seen anyone else wear wear these. These are still still reflective. Yeah, so that's a sneaker. Alright, have a hat. Here's a hat. Fun fact, this hat, uh, thanks to this hat, I gained quite a few TikTok followers because Come Direct ASMR duetted a video while I was wearing this one. Tapping and snapping. And it has almost, I think like 100,000 views on my own. Oh, this is gonna be great for my hair on my own um, account, and 1.5 million views as of this morning, I checked on Come to Rest's account, which is just so crazy, it's so crazy. But yeah, I'm a big fan of this hat. I don't, I'm not much of like a baseball fan. Baseball's fine, I don't watch baseball. And sorry, I keep readjusting. My chair is like too big for my desk, so I keep like bumping it. Anyways. Um, I 
like the hat because I like when baseball hats are just like hats with the rims aren't like don't have the hole. I like when they're just like flat like this. But it's hard to find hats like that that actually fit me. But I have a few because I, I look out for them. Nice. My hands are already feeling kind of dirty because I don't, I don't know, you know? Also, the lighting is going to keep changing, I think, because it was sunny. But now the sun seems to be covered by a cloud. I believe it's also supposed to rain and storm soon, which I think could be kind of fun if it does. But, yeah. Anyways, so where have I been? I told you. I was on a flight, and you might have been able to tell from my last two videos. Basically, I spent the weekend... <laughs> I spent the weekend in Chicago. Chicago, Chi-Town. Visiting friends from school and then I spent the week in Los Angeles, the city of angels, uh, visiting family because I have um, some family out there. And both trips were nice, can't complain. I saw the Barbie movie for the second time, which reminds me, gotta show you something cool. Oh gosh, this is maybe a bad idea. Check this out. This is like a popcorn bucket. It's also filled with chunks right now. Um, yeah, so I was on vacation. This hat, I love this hat. I mean, I almost never wear it anymore. It is so old and beat up. You can tell it's basically brown. And I've actually washed it not too long ago. It is just... This hat has been through a lot. I've had it for probably five or six years, but I would wear it to work out. I'd wear it to the beach, to, to wherever. This was just my hat. I've made a lot of videos actually in this hat. I just wear it like that. Maybe I'll keep doing that the rest of the video. Anyways, um, the vacation was nice. Again, saw the Barbie movie. Um, Cause I was thinking family, we didn't do a whole lot. Um, went swimming. I ran, I ran a lot. I ran a lot. Okay, let's do another shoe. I'm kind of all over the place. I have a lot more shoes and a lot more hats to get through still. These shoes, I almost never wear, which is crazy because I actually love them. I think they're and they're, I mean, you can tell they're so clean. Like, I mean, so clean by my standards. Because I never wear them. But, what are these? 270, 270s? I don't know. I don't know. Um, I'm trying to think when, where, and why I got these. But I can't remember. I think I just thought they, I just wanted more, like, sneaker-looking shoes. I, I never, I almost never wear these. I don't know why. I just feel like I don't have a lot that goes with them, even though it could kind of go with anything. But kind of pink, kind of Barbie, Barbie core, which is fun. 270 React. React. So they are basically just running shoes, yeah? I don't know. But they're like felt, felt. The bottoms aren't that dirty by my standards. Yeah, okay. Another shoe down. Let's do another one. Oh, these shoes. <laughs> I don't know the thing about them. I I mean I okay, for the record, I've picked out shoes that are, I guess, my more expensive, nice sneakers. I don't know. Ones that I think are a little bit more impressive than my everyday shoes. For the most part, I just wear Vans or Air Forces. I am very low maintenance with my shoes. Say five to six days out of the week. But one day out of the week when I wanna wear a little fire on my feet, I got shoes like these. 
these are Jordans. Um, embarrassed, I don't know Jordan what's. If you like sneakers, don't come for me in the comments. I promise I used to, I used to be better. I don't know, I don't think I actually was. But these are cool. These are like also felt and have, I don't know what kind of pattern this is called, but this pattern. And I actually bought these for an event, for an event, because my pant design was the same as this, and I thought, that's, that's kind of matching fun. Anyways, yeah, these ones, yippee. Oh, I landed on my carpet, hold on. Oh. Okay, 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 rock on, rock on, rock on, rock on. Okay, um, yeah, this video is gonna be a long one. Hoping my iPhone storage can hold up. I guess I can try to stop rambling so much now and um, just do the tapping on the things with maybe a brief explanation of what I'm, what shoe or how I tapped on. I'll try. I don't know. It's probably gonna be pretty rambly. Sorry. Like I said, I haven't talked to my homies in a while. I got one, two, three, four pairs of shoes. Okay, let's start getting through some of my hats. This one is probably my most expensive and nicest hat. A little polo beanie. I love this hat. I got this as a Christmas Christmas birthday gift to myself last year, two years ago. Um, but I love it. It's wonderful. Good decision on my part. Um, how about this one? Another winter hat. This one's fun. Um, it's covered in dog fur, but it's, I don't know, one of these kind of hats and super cozy, super plush. I wear this all the time in the winter because the winters here are, I won't say brutal because <laughs> there are some real brutal winters out there in certain places, but they can get cold, cold, snowy, sucky. Um, but yeah, big fan of this hat. All right, let's do let's do this one. I think I'm saving probably four of my most interesting hats for the end. This hat, again, like because it fits my head, and um, there's no hole in the back, no adjustable hat. And I like this brown because I like neutrals. I like neutrals. Um, I don't. I couldn't care less for Duke. Sorry if you're a Duke fan, um, but I recently got stain on it. Like I took it on vacation with me vacation I took it on some trip with me like a long time ago maybe earlier this summer I don't know I'm losing my mind um and like the shampoo or something like broke and even though I always protect my shampoo and put it in bags it like leaked and got on the hat which is really too bad I mean it's not terrible you can't really tell much but I know it's there and it bothers me Um, this Thursday, hopefully, I'm going to have a, a video coming out that I'm really excited about, assuming I film it and edit it in time. Yeah, I mean, edit is a strong word, it's not going to be a lot of edits, but I think it's going to be good. I'm kind of, um, knocking off, recreating, um, one of my favorite kind of ASMR videos that, I mean, they get a lot of views. I'm being so vague right now. They get a lot of views, but I don't know how well known they actually are, especially in the lo-fi community, if you will. We have 
these guys. I they're just skate shoes, I think. Um, I just I, I got them forever ago. I think off like Depop or eBay. I don't know. I just really like the pattern on them, the design. I never wear these, but I like them. I just own too many shoes, you know. And that's why I actually gave a lot of them away. I feel like over spring break, not too long ago, this year, um, probably like six or seven pairs of sneakers. But gosh, I had some ugly sneakers. <laughs> like I. When I first started liking shoes, um, sneakers, I just like, I mean, I still only get whatever I think I would actually wear and think are cool looking, but gosh, my taste has changed quite a bit. I used to have these like bright orange Jordan 4s, I think, like neon highlighter orange, could see them from a mile away, kind of cool, but gosh, they were hideous. I love orange, orange is my favorite color, but they were... They were ugly. They were ugly shoes. I figured this video would be pretty long. I wanted to do a longer video since I've done shorter ones recently. But yeah, I only... I have... I've been trying to plan out videos, like what I'm going to do when a little bit better um and i believe i only have two maybe three if i'm feeling ambitious videos planned before i go back to school that's crazy to me and i already already have like a video schedule for the most part worked out in my head about when i want to film and upload a tentative two days a week very least one day a week hopefully the same day every week um but hopefully two days a week it might kind of depend on the week and how busy i am you know but i will be busy i will be a busy 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 ball Has three shoes. Let's let's four hats, three shoes. Let's do another hat then. This hat you might have been seeing somewhat recently. I've been wearing it occasionally in my videos. I'm obsessed. I, when I tell you I'm obsessed, I'm obsessed. I love bucket hats. Even though funny enough, I don't. I think this is the first bucket hat I've actually shown. Hmm. I have a few more bucket hats, but I didn't. They're not in this pile because they're just tan. Kind of just more like safari-like hats, whatever. Um, but I love Carhartt. I don't think I have any Carhartt beanies here either, even though I have, I think, three Carhartt beanies. Um, but like a Sherpa Carhartt bucket hat, covered in dog fur. Um, enough said. I think it's spectacular. I think it's spectacular. I'm so excited to decorate my room this fall. Um, I have my own room for the first time going to college, even though I'm gonna miss my roommate. I'm gonna miss, I mean, she's still gonna live in the same house as me, but I'm gonna share my room with her because we're two people who have like grown up not sharing a room and somehow it just worked. It was just perfect. We were very compatible roommates gonna be sharing a hallway and a bathroom so don't worry I mean not that I think you were worried but I'm really just reassuring myself not to worry oh, one more thing I want to show you before I forget is I don't know if you've been ooh, it's kind of gross but I don't know if you've been keeping up with my journey to get all the post Malone Canes cups I have the other two here. I had these look very similar, but they are actually different. But now, boom, three out of four. Three out of four. I just gotta get the last one before I leave for school.
right, let's do another shoe. These shoes I got exactly four years ago uh, in France. That's right, France. They are actually, in fact, French colors. They are, um, they were made for, I believe, I, don't quote me, um, because of the Women's World Cup going on in France at the time. These were like in support of the French team. And I, again, these are a pair of shoes I almost never wear. But I think they're very pretty. Oh, that's a goofy. I mean, like, look at that. I think they're cool. I think they're cool. super excited to decorate my room and kind of get a good ASMR setup hopefully. This summer it's kind of been all over the place. I mean basically in my room for the most part. Um, but sometimes you see like that wall in the background. Sometimes you see this one and it'll given I'll be in a very small room. Uh, I'll have to be very efficient with my space. But I'm excited. I'm just excited for it. Now this hat, another bucket hat, I mean that is just cool, isn't it? Like that is a swanky little hat. I found this at Goodwill uh, two or three summers ago. I don't, I mean, it's a pretty bold statement, so I don't like wear it terribly often. But more often than you'd probably think. I don't know, it, it reminds me of Dr. Seuss, like it's such a Dr. Seuss hat. I think it's so fun. Bit a little bit on that one. Sorry. All right, all right, all right. These are probably the nicest pair of sneakers I have at the moment. I got these just like probably a month ago um, at a secondhand store in Columbus, and they're called like. Jordan first class, Jordan 1 first class sneakers. Bottom are a little worn, but they look basically brand spanking new. I've only worn them a couple times, I think, maybe only once or twice. Um, it's a lot of yellow. I don't know how much I love the yellow, but I couldn't, I couldn't not get them. I basically stole them. They were $80 when, if I wanted to get these in my size, like online, $170 minimum, minimum. And then they were having like a discount at the store that day. So I got some other things too. And I got everything for like less than $60, maybe $70. I got like a bunch of other clothes too, including a hat I'm gonna show you soon. Um, so like I like a steal, I just had to, I just had to. Closing in on the end, the, the last couple hats and shoes. Um, this one, this is a fan favorite of my friends. It has the whole whatever, I guess so does this one, it's like my favorite hat, but whatever. Um, no brim, no brim, cap no brim. And so I love wearing it like this. People expect there to be something in the back. 
I love it. I'm obsessed. It's awesome. I think it's so funny. People really like it. It's just fan favorite. Fan favorite of the hat. Pair of sneakers, pair of sneakers. I only have been bringing one at a time. Did you know? Did you know? And my last hat. These have aged so much in the past month. Oh, it's getting dark outside again. Dark. I think it's gonna storm soon. Whatever. Um, these are my running shoes. I love them. I love them to death. They're my babies. I I got slandered by my friend groups. Um, sorry, I just got a text. Ignore that. I got slandered by my friends in my friend group. Did I say that? Doesn't matter. Um, because I never owned a pair of running shoes. I had the same pair of sneakers, like tennis shoes, like running shoes, shoes that you could actually exercise in. I had the same ones since fourth grade up through high school and then I didn't get any when I went to college and I just threw them away. Actually, I don't know if I did throw them away. They might be in my closet. Um, and as a college athlete, it seems a little silly to not have a pair of tennis shoes, shoes that you can run in. But I tell you, I hate running. Like, why would I want to run for fun? I, when I exercise, it's usually in my soccer cleats. Like, why would I need a pair of running shoes? So we went shopping one day and I was like, should I just do it? Should I just get a pair of running shoes? And they're all like, yes, get a pair of running shoes. I did and I love them because my problem with running shoes is they I think they're ugly I just think all basically all running shoes are just ugly looking shoes I'm an aesthetics person and maybe that sounds ridiculous after showing you my nice shoes and maybe you're not that impressed with it totally fine totally fair I just don't like the shape and clunky style of running shoes I know they're good for you but they're just not for me they're not for me these little guys I fell in love with they're still a little clunkier than I prefer, especially in the heel variety, but there are no laces. There are no laces, just slip on, which I think makes them cooler. Um, I like the colors. Yeah, this was big for me. Now they're kind of dirty, but this was big for me after getting a pair of running shoes. And now my hands are really dirty because those, those, I ran out in the mud a little bit today. Not the mud, but a trail. I ran on the road in the trail. This trail has dirt. Now I'm like getting crazy from doing this for so long and I'm so hungry. I'm so hungry. I can't wait to get food, but I don't know what I'm gonna eat. I don't have any food. It's okay. All right, I'm gonna show you my last hat as I am outroing and thank you guys. That was my stomach. Thanking you guys for, like we're so close to 3K. So close, so close. And I'm gonna do, I, keep, I always said that if I said it for like 1k and 2k that I'm gonna do something special and I kind of never really did this time. I'm gonna do something special. <laughs> when I hit 3k, um, I guess, I'm not gonna tell you what it is yet. I'm not gonna tell you what it is. In one to two videos from now, I'll tell you what it's gonna be so you can help me prepare for it. That's all I'll say. That's all I'll say for now. Flip or tweet. All right. Bye, guys. Thanks for watching.